good. Yeah, I know. Sitting down like a good girl. Get my shoes on. Now, should we go? Should we go? For the walkies. Get your little head twitch when you say that. Walkies. You're like, lead. <laughs> All right, sit down. Sit down. Good girl. Good girl. Aww. Aww. Yeah, you're a clever girl, aren't you? You can do porn and everything. I know you can, but you're just going for... Which way should we go, Els? This way it is. Okay, so this is just one of Ella's short walks because she usually does either two short walks a day or she does one longer walk with my dad. So, like, sometimes I'll take her out for a walk, some days I don't. Like, it's a bit hit and miss. Like, we don't schedule in specific, like, walks or routes that she has to do to, like, keep fit. She's, like, a pretty small dog, so she doesn't have, like, um... A really harsh schedule. I know that some big dogs they tend to have like oh you need to do about 60 minutes a day or whatever like with Ella it's it's not really like that and the garden that we have is quite big so I think if you give your dogs like a lot of space then they can just run around as they please. She plays with the guinea pig and the um, rabbit rather a lot jumping around all over their cages so she just becomes quite strong and quite active anyway um, she's also got five of us in the house that play with her and I think that's a massive help so if you've got more people to play with them then it keeps them active the only thing that like I would say is like if you're really worried about like the activity levels of your dog like just make sure that they're not trapped in the house all the time even if they have a tiny little paddock area to go to I hope you can hear me over the wind even um, if there's a tiny area for them to go to they're getting outside they're getting that fresh air and they're choosing when they like wander around and like dogs they do want to move they're not just they're not just lazy okay so today's Sunday the 16th of September this morning I haven't really done much I had a little lay-in then I went to church with my sister we live near a local church now that sounds a little bit funny for me to say because um, like I'm not actually like really religious um, I'm not christened um, I have my own beliefs which obviously everybody has um, but there was a reason that I wanted to go to church this morning and my sister just accompanied me which was really nice to not go alone and have like support when I'm a tad emotional but I'm going to touch upon that subject. Oh, she just saw a squirrel. <laughs> we got a lot of animals around here actually. The other day we had um, deer and we have peacocks and we have a lot of squirrels, a lot of dogs. We've got a goat at the end of the drive, plenty of cows, rabbits, guinea pigs. We basically live, well we do, we live in farming areas surrounded by fields. I actually live it and wouldn't want to live in the city. I love the city when I go, but I'm always ready to come home and like I'm very much a country girl. So yeah, what was I talking about? Yeah, so at the moment I'm like a tad a bit emotional, but um I'm gonna touch upon that subject like another day. I think I'm gonna do a long like chatty video because obviously today you guys uh Ella Ew um are not seeing me. It's more of like a walk chat talk about just like my chill vibe Sundays, like what do you guys get up to? I'd love to know. I'd love to know what you guys want to see. This afternoon we're doing a baking video, but I'm going to upload that separately. Um, yeah, so we're just going to bake some cakes, some maid of honours, and maybe make some jelly because I'm obsessed with jelly at the moment. But um, yeah, I'll do another chatty video on like my emotional state at another time. It's been a very strange year, but I've got... Um, like I'm kind of using not like YouTube as a diary but I suppose I'm taking you guys along on like certain journeys and I quite like to make like these little series to like help you so like obviously I had busy bee hacks I'm now creating a food series creating a uh, workout series because I've got a lot more of those to come for you and more information videos to come so this is more of like a 
up on how Ella is doing because she hasn't had Ella's adventures in a while. And to walk and chat on this lovely Sunday afternoon with me. So yeah, when we get back, I'm going to get some uh, food, late lunch, and I'm then going to do some baking with my sister. Um, and yeah, probably then watch um, series. At the moment, my sister and my boyfriend and I are all watching um, the Walking Dead series, which I I love it. I think it's I think it's great. Um, but I need another series to watch at the same time because we don't all get the chance to be in all the time at the same time. So if anybody's got any series they recommend, please put them in the comment section below. But yeah, as for Walking Dead, it's made me become very, like, very aware of um, my surroundings. Like, I live in the countryside, and then I think to myself, well, there's no one here as it is. So, like, the zombies would come from, like, Boston, <laughs> and they'd come from all the surrounding areas. I just, like, board up my, my little home and hope for the best. No, it's quite like it does make you think weirdly i was in i was shopping yesterday in peterborough and we got in the lift and i said to my sister oh my gosh what about if you were stuck in a lift like this is a walking dead moment right now i feel like it's affecting my life more than it should but um yeah so as you can see we're approaching a field that's got some cows in ellie's not really too bold about the cows but i think they get a bit frightened of her we went to the marsh the other day walking and one of the cows ran away when it saw Ella. I felt quite sorry for it actually. And it was mooing like quite aggressively, which I've never heard one move quite like that. Oh, she's pulling now. I think she's noticed the cow. What's that else? What's it? What's that else? And it's very intrigued in people and very intrigued in other animals. Since we get in since we've got the rabbit, I think you've seen Coda on here once. Um she's obsessed. Like you take the rabbit out and she is just basically bathing it as if it's its own if as if it is her own like, oh, what's that else can't get to it can you look at your windswept face ella um yeah i don't really have anything else to say um but just wanted to quickly go over the support that i have for my channel so um started in January so it hasn't been very long and I hope to have 300 subscribers by the end of the year so please please share um, and get your friends to subscribe to my channel and yeah just expect a lot more I think this year has been very all over for me because I've kind of like gone from um, my fitness to my food to lifestyle to hacks to, to quite like finding my niche but I know what I want to put out there now and how I want to help people so and that is what my YouTube channel is about as well as like having fun and watching our silly videos and then making you laugh and brighten up your day that's exactly what I want to do but I also want to help you guys like put out information that is not so like sometimes I'll say something just like when I'm at work and someone will say oh my goodness like really is, is that what happens to our bodies to our minds obviously I have a lot of information on like um, fitness diet nutrition and I'm still learning for you guys but I am happy to share it and that's what I want to do so um, alongside the lifestyle stuff and the vlogs of course um, I'm going to be changing up my YouTube a little bit but that is in the future to come it's basically in the behind the scenes um, but it will be coming to you soon so please like if you're interested in that kind of stuff then please stick around and subscribe and leave me any comments below message me any video ideas or something that you'd like to see something that you'd like to know questions i will give you the answers um honestly and yeah thank you so far for the support that i have had i have had also some negative vibes but i just cut them out my life so all positive vibes here please <laughs> okay um happy sunday to you angels and i'll see you in the next hello adventure or um series or vlog or workout
more fitness chatty video bye guys